What is up everybody, this is Tyler from 200 Listening News, and I decided finally to get around to doing another one of these videos. This is going to be a tour on Alpha Factions. Now, Alpha Factions, as you might know, is my Minecraft server. It is a faction of PvP server, and since the last time I've done a video about this server, not that much attraction has really been going on on it. Uh, we've gotten a lot more players since I made that video. Uh, approximately, like, 60 more players. They don't, a lot of them are kind of inactive at the moment, but we do have a decent amount of players that come on from time to time, and I'm proud and, and I'm proud and pleased to announce that the machine that is currently hosting this server is a full-blown Ubuntu server machine that is strictly dedicated to hosting the server. And the machine itself has a Core 2 Quad Q6600, 8 gigabytes of RAM, and there's nothing really else to really look forward to on that machine. But from that, besides the other half, it's a really good machine. It's hosting the server beautifully. There is absolutely no problems with it. So this server is completely lag-free, and I don't think I could show you actually because it's fraps. But if you were to look into the console, it maybe skips ticks maybe when people do heavy world edits. Like, I'm talking about world edits over a million blocks. Then it skips like 50, 50 or 40 ticks. Um, so the last time you've seen this, a lot has actually changed. If you've ever watched the previous video. The first thing that really changed is that uh, the PvP world is now finished. It's been finished for a while. I'm still doing some work on that, but we'll return to that. Uh, the server shop has changed a lot, too. If you remember this shop, it, it's definitely got renovated and it looks a lot nicer. There is a, uh, you know, a server review box right here. As you can see, server shop. You walk in here. These are not currently used, but if you go over here to these shelves, there are items that you may buy and purchase uh, for your sake of being. As you can see, like, as an example, let's say I want to buy dirt. Oh, crap. I have fell on slash clear. Right, so let's say you want to buy cooked steaks. You click this, you want to sell cooked steaks, you press that. It all depends on the amount of money you have. Um, moving over here, there's some more items. And there's also, in addition to a new section of the shop, uh, this is for me only, um, there's a new addition, there's an addition to the new section of the shop, and it's called the High Roller Access Area. This is the High Roller Patio Area. As you can see, there's some little chairs and whatnot. And down over here, there's a hot tub. And this actually does work, watch. This is just a simple redstone creation. It's nothing really to be credited about, but it does lag some people. And once you get far enough away from it, it'll actually stop. See? It stops on its own. It's on a timer. Or not a timer, but it's on a, uh, <laughs> that's a long story. But it's on a, uh, a tester. And if you go, you can go back through here. Only high rollers have access to this area, so... If you do come on the server, there is a code I'm giving out. The code is gone. The promo code is called um, what should I name? Poop. Screw it. The promo code is called Poop. If you watch this video and there's an admin online and they say and they you join here, especially if it's either me or another admin, or put in the server box. Actually, just write a thing that says uh, a quote unquote um, I have access to it, um, and such on. You know, I just got a message. Excuse me. But just write on a message or, or whatever. Just like tell a server admin to talk to me. To if they if they if you can talk to me or if they can get me on the server. Uh, my name is Tyler or Alpha Given Forty Three. All the admins know me. They should know what to do. And if you give me the correct promo code, I'll give you instant high roller access. What high roller access gives you is it gives you access to the patio, uh, access to very special items, as in the high roller shop up here. Which a lot of the items are currently not in sale right now because there was a huge glitch and we lost some of the items. But you can buy these awesome items as an example, a dildo that's actually pretty overpowered. Uh, I don't know, what spawn is sheep? Here, just watch this. Ready? Oh, it doesn't do it. It must be glitched. Oh. I gotta fix that, but this this item right here that used to be uh where you used to be able to actually um kill things one hit with it. And there's all sorts of cool things like I know here. 
like the high roar axe. This 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 actually does work. Um, where the sheep go? It doesn't actually strike lightning. That was just a PT command I had. Um, here we watch. I'll do it again. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Gives you cooked food and whatever. So uh, these these are free items that you can get in the shop. Oh, excuse me, I just sneezed. Um, so that's all fun. You can also get free access to other areas. There will soon be a high roller section into the shop and um, over here. So let's go look around at the other stuff. First thing is Tanner or Tanner the Great Twos, or he's one of the. He used to be an admin, but he's still a. He's still a cool guy, but he comes on the server. And this was his design, the server sh the server admin house. I renovated it a little. It came out much nicer. I noticed that's different. And the PvP portal. So let's go into the PvP portal. So just so we can get a little bit of a look at what happened. So this is the PvP world. Oh, wow. Okay, hold on. Slash game rule. Uh, should be game rule command. Put false. Oops. Sorry, I'm a little typing slow. I'm kind of distracted. Um, log. I'm a commands. Rolls. There was a minor glitch when we switched host machines where it actually went ahead and disabled a bunch of stuff in the game rules and also in some of the stuff. But as you can see, it's a portal back, whatever. You know, this is basically the PvP spawn arena. Right here, you got a PvP spawn house, PvP shop, and PvP pregame house. PvP shop's already good. You saw the spawn house. So thank you, Jay. Um, one of my friends made this. This is basically where you can buy diamond kits for PvP and such on. It's not entirely done yet, though. Um, the pregame house. I gotta show you how this works. This is pretty damn cool. I wired this up myself using redstone. There are no commands, or not. There is commands, but there's no, um,. There is no actual plugins for this. So it says lobby one waiting for players. You click on the sign. Oh. What the frick? Why does it not work? Don't tell me it broke that too. Okay. That's not working. Um, I think I might know why. Really? Okay. Yeah, that's an issue. That's never happened before. Um, I'm still working out the bugs with the PvP lobby, but what happened is it says lobby when waiting for players. You click the sign, it would come up with a menu out here. You either click A or Team A or Team or Team One, Team Two. Team One's blue. Team One's T Two is red. You click it, and it would say which one you would want to join. You can change at any point. You click it, it spawns you into the lobby and changes your gamer tag. Apparently, there's something wrong, and it's not working. I have no idea what could have possibly went wrong, but it's clearly something very serious. Uh, I'll fix it later, but that's just a quick update. I'm not going to show you what the PvPs look like. Me, Technology's Edge, and Dust Sam Nudge plan about uploading some videos on here of PvP. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Other than that, there's not really much to show. Like, of course, there's a bunch of new bases on here. One cool thing is... Ugh, I'm getting a call. I can wait, though. One cool thing, though, is that... Um, well, what was I saying? One cool thing, though, about the Factions World is we now added the Dynamap. Uh, if you click this link right here, of the factions.hop2.org, 8123, or colon 8123, you can actually go to the Dynamap. It'll click yes. Of course, though, you can't see that because it pulls up in my other screen. But it gives you a full, like, map of what the world is like. So that's pretty cool for anyone that's interested in uh, playing on here. Of course, the faction spawn, you guys all know this place. Uh, there's a lot of commotion that's been going around on the spawn. So if you do hop on the server, I suggest you find a base far away from everyone. Because this place is, like, this, this whole area is like crazy like over here there's like a little base that was never finished and it's just really crazy over here so yeah that's all i have to say so thanks for watching comment subscribe and i'll see you guys later